Hey beautiful people, welcome back to the channel everyone. I appreciate you being here, thank you. I've gone right to the T on this because the last collective reading was showing that this person somehow was trying to blame you. And I'm going to try and figure out what this person is up to, Spirit. What is this person up to? Are they trying to mind a game? Yeah, they are. They are. They're trying to, like, mind game you into some kind of taking action on them. They're trying to play a mind game with you somehow to make you take action. What the hell are they up to? It says they're trying to hustle you, but you know what they're up to. They're broke. Playing games. What are they up to with my collective spirit? Thank you guys so much for your generosity, your likes, your comments, your subs. Guys, I am going to be doing giveaways soon, so if you haven't subscribed, you may want to. We're giving some of these Feng Shui manifestation uh, holders away, guys, as well as some other gifts, and I'm not letting on what they are. Mm-hmm. Believing lies and supporting untruths without investigating them. This person is thinking they're better than you. Makes others feel guilty for having other plans. Uh-huh. Their little side chick or side piece is accusing you. Accusing you of harm, trying to harm them. But it was them doing it. Oh my God. So they're gonna kind of ganging up on you. Could have gotten an STD. Hmm. Oh, Jesus. Put on blast for their toxic internet schemes. This... There's a real game going on today, and I'm not sure who's doing what. It's almost like they're ganging up on you. This side piece, or whoever they are, does not want you to know how much this person cares about you. Um, they're faking. They're a fake. They think they're better than you. Your person is participating in the gossip and in the rumors. They're doing things... on the internet... They're trying to act all like 
sophisticated, maybe like putting their secret rendezvous online or something like that. It's because this karmic is irritated of you and the karmic seems to be accusing you of harmful intent. They're trying to throw others off their own guilty. They're guilty. They're trying to throw others off by blaming you what they actually did. So there's no doubt that this karmic is saying to this person that you are trying to say shit about them on the internet or trying to intimidate them on the internet when it was them doing it all along. They're the ones that are guilty of it. But they're like accusing you of putting things online about them, but they're the ones guilty of doing it. And it's like they're trying to like gang up on you somehow. This is the side piece that is trying to accuse you of harmful intent to throw others off their own guilty scent. Oh, come on. They're like acting like they're afraid of you or like acting like... To make it up shit and pretending it's you doing it to them when it's them doing it to you. What is, that's the side piece doing this. Fake friend secretly wants you to fall. And tries to be better than you do it. And this karmic is acting clueless to see how far people try to take advantage. Their bills are more than their salary. Trying to make ends meet. So this person... Is faking. Spreading lies because they're intimidated and insecure by you. So this person, your person is acting like... They got a bunch of money, but the fact is, is that they're going broke. They're trying to act like they're superior, that they got some kind of more money than you, or that they somehow have risen up in the world since they met this karmic. This karmic is lying, saying that you're doing something on the internet to intimidate them or make them afraid. Oh, you. You're, that's because things are looking up for you. They see? And they're taking notes and they're watching how you do it. Because you're moving on with your life and you're saying goodbye. J Internet trolls, jealous of what you have and how you appear. Playing poker. Okay, so this little side chick or side piece, take it as it resonates, is saying that you're making things up on the internet about them, but it's them doing it. They're trolls. Your person is a troll, 
and so is the person that they're dealing with. They're both trolling you. Oh my God. And your person is believing it all without even consulting you or going to you to find out if it's the truth. They're believing this little freak. I'm sorry for saying the word freak, but I'm mad. Your person is a troll and so is the little side fling or piece that they're with. They're believing this uh, person, but the fact is they're lying. They're covering up their own tracks. They were saying shit about you and then pretending that you're saying shit about them. What a psycho, man. It's because you are getting a windfall. They're unstable, man. They're a fool. I'm sorry, but they are. They're faking. Oh, Jesus. So I told you they're going broke, but they're faking like they got some big amount of money coming in. It's a lie. You're the one getting the windfall. They're faking that they got a windfall. Trying to like, um, they think they're better than you. It's the Empress who is getting justice. It is the Empress who is telling the truth. It is the Empress. And this person's the lies, gossip, and rumors. They listen to it and they are participating in it. Yes, they are. Told ya. Trolls, man. Internet trolls. Fake news, fake news. Trying to like make you feel guilty of spreading rumors or lies or gossip, but they're the ones doing it. It's this side piece that's doing this. You're too respectful to do anything like that. Mm -hmm. See, they're faking that they're wealthy. They're playing a game. It's because you are highly respected. It is because you are the Empress and the Temperance Angel why this is all happening. You. They pretend that they don't care, but they do. Hmm. Internet trolls spying. Spying on your platform if you have one. They're spying on you. Or they're spying on your business. Or they're spying on you. If you have a platform, a podcast, or anything like that, They're spying on your social media, if you have it. Your social platform, if you have one. They're internet trolls on your platform. Or your podcasts, or whatever you do. It's King of Wands, man. What? Oh, come on. It's drama. Trolls starting drama. So what they're pretending, okay? This side piece of crap who's nothing more than a drama starter and a troll. 
okay? They're spying on you. They're taking notes on what you say, trying to copy you, duplicate you, and do it better than you. <laughs> Saying that you're trying to intimidate them. I'm afraid. They're making me afraid. Psycho. It's because they're intimidated by you. It's a cover up. They're trying to cover up the truth. up their own tracks. They're guilty. They're doing it to hurt you because you walked away. They're saying that you're putting things on the internet, making some kind of accusations or threats about them, this side piece. Yeah, it is. Internet. Because they're intimidated by you. They're trying to make you jealous. They're trying to get others to judge you. See what else they're up to. They're broke. <laughs> and trying to pretend that they got money. I'm telling you. Because they can't get over you. So they troll you. I think that they're deliberately trying to like provoke you. You're just busy working your ass off for this money. Mm hmm
They can't get over you. So whoever this little side piece is, this little number, they're trying to provoke some kind of anger out of you. They're trying to provoke some kind of confrontation or conflict. Why? Because you're quiet, you're silent, you're not engaging, you're doing your own thing. And whoever this side piece is, they're trying to like, look like they're having fun, look like they're... It's because this person wants you back and they want a confrontation. This person wants a conflict, okay? Trying to get a rise out of you. They totally believe their own lies and they swear it's the truth. The two of the freakers, man. I'm telling you. Hiding their addictions due to shame and guilt of their own illegal activity. So you may have trolls on the internet and making accusations about you, saying unfalse truths about you. It's not the truth. It is simply not the truth. Vengeful, getting others to do their dirty work. They're just ostracizing themselves because nobody buys their bullshit. You... <laughs> So it's looking like they have made a careless mistake that it's affecting them in the long term. It looks like the cops are pulling them over for something. Oh. And it may be affecting their job with their extreme views. And I mean, this is someone with extreme points of view. Whoever the side piece is, uh, they're, they're getting in trouble with their own bosses. They've got extreme points of view. Extreme. They're, they're like... Because they're afraid of losing. People are talking shit, making up lies to sound important. Be careful who you share your secrets with. Oh yeah, because this is one little side piece here who is determined to work hard to get attention and get noticed by others. And they don't care if they sell this per what shit they got to make up, what view, what point of view that they got to spread. They just, they want attention. They're totally, they're out of control. Cries wolf. When they're the perpetrator. telling you right now they're doing nothing right now but playing a huge huge ass game I don't know what has uh, just happened and transpired but they're they're playing a huge ass game They were playing you, okay? Who 
whoever they're dealing with is an extremist. They're an extreme troll. They could be watching your platform if you have one. And they're putting trollish comments on your page to cover up their own guilt and their own shame of the bullshit they spread about you. So they're trying to make it look like you are the one spreading bullshit about them. <laughs> Who has time for this idiotic crap? <laughs> so they may be posting things online, uh, trying to get a reaction out of you. They're, I don't know, they're just trying to get a reaction out of you. They're a bunch of idiots. The two of them, I don't care how many are involved, they're just idiots. They're trying to get a reaction out of you because you are minding your own business. You're being silent. You're doing your own thing. You moved on and so they, they're all mighty in numbers or something like that. You know what I mean? They're a bunch of jerks. All they are are trolls. They got nothing better to do with their life than stay the hell out of your business. There's something wrong with them. If they can't mind their own business, what does that say? These people are sickening. When are people going to grow up? Seriously, I mean, they mustn't have much of a life if they're always up in your business. If they're making up stories about you and spreading lies and rumors about you and then have to go cover up all their tracks to the point where they actually believe their freaking lies. Oh, I'm scared. The, the collective did this, the collective did that, and the collective is being quiet, minding their own business. You're not even looking at them. So, I don't know. Spirit better do something just. What spirit can do about this situation? Oh, so what I'm hearing for some of the third parties, they're like even getting trouble at work with their extreme political viewpoints. They're even making trouble for themselves at work. What is going to be the karma here, Sarah? be the karma here. It's the third party that's spying on you. Well, they're going to get a tower, whoever these trolls are that are trolling you, trolling your page, trolling your life, whatever. They're going to get a karma. They're going to get a tower. They're going to regret it. Trying to slow you down. They ain't going to be successful, Spirit saying. All it's doing is making this person want you more. And every time they talk shit about you, Spirit saying, Spirit's going to keep blessing you more and more and more. Comes around, goes around. It's work. Spreading shit and rumors at work. And this person is like doing it to cover up their own freaking tracks. 
They're participating in it, man. They're covering up their own freaking guilt. There's going to be justice for the Empress. High Priestess. Spirit's going to get involved here. It's so much to the point that people aren't even trusting them with their, what they say and their own extreme opinions. These are extremists. This um, third party is an extremist. They're jealous of you. And they're jealous because they got themselves trapped with somebody. You're not even looking at them, man. They got themselves stuck. It's their path. And I'm saying, because they're such an extremist, people... <laughs> See? Talking shit, man. these people, man. Just freaking trolls. Waiting, looking for drama. See? Trying to get a rise out of you. That's what they're trying to do. They're trying to get you to respond. Trying to get you. It's baiting you, man. They're trying to bait you into a reaction. Bait you into getting angry. Bait you into some retaliation. They're a bunch of jerks. No wonder you walked away. Now let them stay over there and manipulate all they want. Gossip and rumors. Hmm. Well, it's return to sender. That's their karma. Whatever they were spreading about you, whatever they were saying about you, trolls. Let them do it. The more they do, the more you're blessed. The more they say, the more spirit rewards you. This little whoever it is, even their real people around them don't even trust them because they've, they're an extremist. They've got extreme points of view, extreme, that's dogma. Description of dogma. Here's the 
the definition of dogma? A principle or set of principles laid down by an authority as incontrovertibly true. They're extremists. And even the people around them know that they're extremists. Like if anybody has a point of view, or if anybody wants to do something that they don't agree with, they'll troll you to take you down. Oh my God, these people are hideous. They want to spread dogma about you so that people start forming political opinions of you or beliefs about you. It's spreading dogma so that other people join in and network against you and a bunch of trolls come out here. It's dogma. It's a game. It's an old strategy from way, way, way back. So use your discretion, guys. Don't fall for it. They're trying to rile a response out of you so you trip up. Manipulation 101. Go back to school and learn some other tricks. 